Hello, friends. It is currently 9.20, and I am walking to class for my 9.30. I was going to film, like, the second I woke up, but I woke up at 9.10. <laughs> so, which honestly is normal for me, <laughs> because I just change and brush my teeth and leave, you know? So, yeah, didn't really need to see all that, right? <laughs> But, this is going to be a day in my life, I guess. My life's pretty boring, but I have, like, one other thing to do today, and I was like, oh, we should do a day in my life. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm going to go to class. It is technically the last class period for the Tuesday-Thursday classes before finals. So... This is my last time going into HR. <laughs> I'm pretty sad about it. I like my professor a lot. So, and I enjoyed the class. I really like HR. So, it's kind of sad. Okay, class is now over. So sad. Honestly, that class really has helped me be less scared to do presentations because we had two both of them I did with another person but honestly like I don't know just in that setting it wasn't as scary as it used to be for me and so definitely appreciate that class I'm walking to um, the luncheon for the graduates that my um, department is hosting which is great because i am very hungry so we're gonna see what type of food they got but i'm excited okay i am now currently in the office the organization i work for here on campus has so i'm gonna just study here for about 40 minutes before my next class's final exam starts on a normal day when i don't have that luncheon usually after class i'll go straight here and i will work on any homeworks i have or study for any tests or whatever so my usual day-to-day -day is me coming over here to this office which is also in the middle of <laughs> my department's like professors offices so sometimes i get to like just talk to the professors and stuff so it's it's pretty fun i like my department and my professors and everything home now just finished that exam don't know how i feel about it it honestly could have gone either way <laughs> at this point like we're graduating you know and so like all i want to do is be able to walk <laughs> walk the stage and leave now we're going home and pretty much everything i do after class is entirely up to me so we'll see what i do i do know i need i offered to help Anna, one of my roommates, um, with one of her projects because she needs to learn how to edit. <laughs> so I offered to help her out with that. Don't know when we'll start doing that, but I'm free for the rest of the day. So we shall see. It's only like, it's only 2.10. So that class usually goes until 2.50. One final done um, for me finals week is pretty chill i have one test tuesday and then one on friday on friday is going to be a busy day because not only am i doing that final at 8 a.m but then um my friends that are gonna come to watch me walk the stage will be there will be here 
so we can get lunch or something and then I'll walk the stage that night and then the day after that I leave so it's gonna be pretty hectic but I think I've um, I think I've planned vlogmas well enough to where that won't be too bad too much of an issue with posting and stuff so yeah I can finally get rid of all these papers that I had for this class. This isn't even all of them. I got rid of so many of them already. Good riddance. I am glad to be out of this class. Oh, here's the other papers. I didn't throw them out because I was scared I would need them. But I don't need them anymore because I would never see that man again. <laughs> Which, thank God, he was probably the worst professor I've ever had. My track record with professors is actually pretty good. I think my department, the College of Business, all of my COBA professors have been pretty good. There's probably only one or two where I'm like, you don't know how to teach. You don't know what you're doing. But, for the most part, all my professors have been, like, amazing. I love them all. Um, so... The fact that this professor is not, is the worst one I've ever had, is, doesn't mean that he's like the worst ever to exist. <laughs> but he definitely was not the best one. And he's a psych professor, not a COBA. Just saying. I'm glad that's out of my life forever. He really freaked me out in the beginning of the semester because one of the presentations that I did um, was a group one, and it was a 75-minute workshop. And so, you hear that, and you're like, I'm gonna die. <laughs> but it was actually pretty good, because, like, for a good 30 minutes of it, you're just, um, teaching this other team to do this, like, trust exercise or whatever. Well, the presentation itself wasn't that bad, but I remember this semester going into it and being like, how am I going to survive? I have, like, three presentations to do. They're all with groups or with another person. Like, how am I going to, how am I going to do anything this semester? How am I going to survive it? You know, and now it's, like, over. <laughs> like, it just, it's just done. You know, like it's so, it's so anticlimactic almost. Okay, I figured out what we can do. I realized that the two books I had checked out at the library here on campus are due tomorrow. So I'll go ahead and drop these off and then we can take a little browse through the library um, for one last time. <laughs> That's gonna be so sad, oh my gosh. <laughs> so yeah, I actually, didn't get to read this book um I didn't read it in time pretty much so kind of sad but hopefully I get to hopefully I get to it soon though um but I did finish The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue last night so that was fun and you may be wondering why are you driving to the campus library and it's because I am lazy okay and I feel like it so and I've been walking around all day and I'm tired of it, okay? I don't want to do it anymore. So I'm simply not. I actually know the words, guys. All the things you said in my head, left to share it and forget. Dang it, look. Okay, let's stop before I get copyrighted. <laughs> Should I get New Moon? Even though I've only read Twilight and I read it like two years ago. So I don't really remember much about it. <laughs> Should this be my send-off book? The book to be remembered. <laughs> Get that ugly love away from me. What are you doing here? Alright, we didn't get anything from the library, which is probably a good thing. Um, considering uh, I would have to read it during, during finals week, basically. Um, which I think is doable, but... You know, I don't know. <laughs> it just seems more daunting to check out a library book currently compared to, like, getting it on Kindle Unlimited or something like that. So, I wish I had vlogged a lot more during my college experience because me and my roommates are just, like, 
I just, it's fun to look, those two vlogs I have with them in it, it's just fun to, like, look back on already when it had just happened, let alone, like, if I was watching it a couple years from now, you know? And so I do wish I had started vlogging a lot sooner, um, because, like, literally I'm vlogging now and, like, I'm gonna leave them in, like, a week <laughs> that's so sad bro um but yeah so i'm pretty regretful about that but and it would have been cool for you guys to like get to know them as roommates you know and how they are in my life and stuff but it is what it is currently eating a pancake and sausage on stick i go through random phases where i'm obsessed with these and I'm in that phase currently, so yeah. But I think I'm gonna watch this Christmas because I just realized that it's on Hulu, and this Christmas is one of it's like a staple. I have to watch it every year. Um, I love this Christmas, and I love the last holiday with Queen Latifah and LL Cool J. Love it so much, and I've already watched it twice this season <laughs> because it's on Amazon Prime. So. I was like, oh my gosh, I gotta watch it. So, low-key, should I watch it again? <laughs> I love The Last Holiday for no reason. It's it's just so good, guys. If you've never seen it, we have Amazon Prime. Go watch it. It's a movie from, like, 2006. And it's just... I love it. There's a lot less drama in, this, in The Last Holiday compared to this Christmas. I think we're gonna do The Last Holiday again. <laughs> <laughs> listen do i have a problem maybe do i care no guys update on the exam we use scantrons for this one and so i guess my teacher literally just threw it in the machine and was done because it's barely 4 p.m and I already have my grade. <laughs> the class is over at 2.50. So technically people can test until 2.50. So yeah, but I actually got 200 out of 2.50. And the most I needed was like 70 to be able to at least walk. So I still have my B in the class. So yay. <laughs> okay. So I have not finished The Last Holiday, but this is the third time I'm watching it, so just this season. <laughs> um, so I think we're fine. Um, but I just had the random idea of um, watching Shadow and Bone finally on Netflix, since no one is using Netflix in the living room right now. Um, I figured I could get that started since I um, read the duology and the trilogy already so i think it's about time i finally watch the show especially since they finally um released the season two date for when it's going to come out which i think they said is march 16th so i might as well finally start watching the show um so yeah and while i watch it i will probably be starting my a quizlet for one of my finals that is going to be a lot more difficult um this final is until friday so like a week from now so i don't have to start studying right now really um i have a another exam that's sooner than this one but in that class i do really well on without needing the study um so i'm but this but this one, HR, I need to study for it because these tests are kind of difficult. Um, so I'm going to just get a head start on that, but I'm just kind of like making the Quizlet and stuff. I'm not really like studying, studying, if you know what I mean. So I think that's what I'm going to do for the rest of the night. So yeah, thanks for tagging along with me for the day. Like and subscribe. Happy Vlogmas, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Not me rewinding just because I saw Kaz. <laughs>
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. It's Kaz. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've written one sentence. 